Hello, Cancer. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for tuning in. This will apply to Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Uh, please take general readings with a grain of salt. Keep an open mind as these are general readings. Please like, share this video, subscribe if you have not already. I would really appreciate that. So let's get right into it, Cancer. Let's see what is coming to you in love. You have the magician. What is coming to cancer and love cancer? Okay. What is coming to cancer and love? What is coming to cancer and love? Ooh, okay. Well, cancer, um, King of Cups, Knight of Cups, you have all these love cards. You know, someone pulled a similar reading. Who was that? I believe it was Aquarius. So you could be dealing with Aquarius or a water sign like yourself. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We do have Virgo and Gemini energy. Okay, with this magician. What is coming to Cancer and Love? I feel like Cancer... Okay, we also have... Um, that's Scorpio. I feel like someone's pretty clear, Cancer, about um, making a move towards you. I do feel that way. Remember, anything I'm saying here could be um, your feelings, their feelings. Okay, if you're watching for a Cancer, this could be how the Cancer feels about you at this point in time. What's well, coming to Cancer in love? I just feel like somebody here, we also have Taurus and Leo, but I feel like someone has received some kind of clarity here. Um, and you know, judgment usually shows up when you've made some kind of um, final call on a situation. Um, you know, you've considered everything here and you're doing whatever you feel, you know, whatever the person feels called to do, they're doing it here, okay? What is coming to Cancer in love? Cancer. Okay. You have the star. Um, you could be connected to um, you could be connected to an Aquarius here with the star card. We have the six of wands. What's coming to uh, Cancer in love? Okay. I'm getting some. You can have two people that want you. What's coming to Cancer in love? So some type of final decision or judgment call um, has been made here. And I do get that there was some kind of uncertainty um, or confusion. What is coming to Cancer and love? One more card, please. I feel like someone's actually going to go ahead and follow their, their heart here, Cancer. Okay. That's what I feel. I feel like someone's going to follow their heart and go after this. And what is the person after? I feel like they are after a commitment here, okay? Um, they are after, um, you know, some kind of future that they see with the other person very strongly. Um, you know, there is something about optimism. Uh, there is something about feeling good, feeling confident in um you know what you feel or what you see you know that's just the truth you know the ten of cups is all about having that that picture right that vision of what you want and when this person thinks about you or you know better yet when you think about each other okay you know they, they think about the ten of cups here now the knight of cups is someone who would follow their heart before anything else and um they would follow their intuition with this knight of cups here so something obviously tells this person cancer in particular that uh this this is this is really it here for them okay so what is the magician for cancer and love so because of that they're gonna do their best song and dance here um to make this happen with you cancer that's just the truth and i do think this person that you're dealing with here Maybe in the past they weren't sure or there was some kind of 
denial, you know, being afraid of it. Um, I do feel like this is like a soulmate connection. Um, there's so many indicators of this being a destined type of thing between you and this person. Um, so some of you, there was some type of letdown or pain with regards to this situation. But um, someone is coming into full awareness, Cancer, and this is what they're about to do here. Um, some of you, don't get me wrong, this could be a brand new person. Um, and I do think you and this person have a pretty strong spiritual connection here. And I think that this person is just going to want to go ahead and move forward right away because they feel like it just feels right. You know, I'm just hearing something about it feeling right. Um, tell me about this judgment for cancer. Judgment. Seven of coin. Like I said, there was a little, maybe there were some trust issues here. Um, some kind of hesitation here with the seven of coins, you know, not being sure. Um, you know, wondering if this is, is the juice worth the squeeze? You know, should I go ahead and, you know, and that probably was a, a, a severe block here. Um, but that's coming to an end. This person is no longer unsure um, or scared or whatever it is. Okay. So what is the sun? And this could also be you, Cancer, if you're coming into this awareness of, you know what, I'm going to follow my heart. I'm going to follow my, you know, my intuition, my dreams here and just make it happen with this particular person, you know, because you can feel that. Now you have the Ten of Cups, Three of Coins and Justice. So it just feels right now. This could be somebody who's, who's, you know, <laughs> there, there are quite a few proposal cards. Now there could be a proposal here because this person's so sure. Okay, I'm talking about an engagement or there could just be um, someone asking to start a relationship with you or you're starting a relationship. Okay, because someone feels like it all checks out. That's just the truth. So what is the star? Someone's very hopeful um, and optimistic about this being it. Okay, and they don't want to lose that point blank period. So that is absolutely beautiful. Um and I think that this will be a very supportive uh, partnership if you do decide to, um, you know, be with this person here. Some of you, like I said, there could be marriage happening for you or engagement, or at least that's where it would go. Okay, Six of Wands, the Six of Cups. Yeah, someone could be proposing to you here or a proposal could be made, okay? And there's gonna someone <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, proposal for 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 marriage, proposal for a relationship, whatever. Okay. So that is a beautiful holy thing. My lovely cancer. Okay. Success, nothing but success is coming here. Um, if you, you know, choose to pursue, say yes to this person. Um, I think this person is 100% sure about this cancer, okay? And like I said, you know, the Knight of Cups is the type to follow their heart, okay? It's water energy, which, you know, you know a lot about that cancer. Um, choose to follow their, their heart and their intuition, um, whatever their heart is leading them to do. And, and it's about to lead them to do this. Okay. It's about to lead them to do this. And I get that even if this wasn't someone who per se um, wanted to recognize this connection at first or, you know, fall in love or whatever. Um, yeah, I feel like that's coming to an end. Okay, so what do you have for cancer, please? We have hearts that speak the same language. Okay. Yep, yep. You have rest and recovery before a restart. Answer. These lights don't go off. You know, somebody probably was living in fear, but uh, you know, living in fear doesn't help anything. You have believe in divine timing. 
You also have enlightenment seeing more clearly. So someone sings more clearly. They turn into Stevie Wonder. Is it Stevie Wonder? That sing that song. I can see clearly now the rain is gone. I can see all cancer is the one. <laughs> all right, so here we go. You know, we have we are divine counterparts. So I mean that 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 I don't know what else you guys want me to say, Cancer. Okay. This is what they want. Give them what they want, Cancer, okay? <laughs> All right. So Yeah, I'm nervous to talk to you. I have childhood trauma. Dreaming of you. Have you're so beautiful. Mm -hmm. Wine and dine. This could be coming from a Taurus. Okay. Um someone recognizes that it's not you it was them or the other way around if this person somebody was emotionally unavailable or nostalgia what else do we have for cancer very possessive please take me back okay so that is what i have for you cancer and we have we belong together and i was seeing leo here just now okay So this person is very possessive over you. They're not going anywhere. And they strongly feel like this is what it is, Cancer, okay? That's what they feel. Yep. So Cancer, that is what I have for you. I hope you guys enjoyed this reading and it gave you the clarity that you needed. And we will talk again soon.